Ladies and gentlemen, welcome aboard Foreign Strategies. Prepare for takeoff. Yo, what's good, guys? So, doing a little different format since uh, we're starting a new series. So, for this video, I'm going to go ahead and do a voiceover until I uh, figure out how the format is going to work from here on out. But pretty much here in the video, as you can see, I'm still in Florianopolis, but in a new neighborhood called Lagoa Concio. Um, I'm not sure if I'm saying that correctly. I did the Google Translate um, before the video, but I think I already forgot it. Um, but <laughs> the neighborhood is located on the east side of the island. Uh, it took about, I think, about 20 minutes to get here from Centro, where I'm staying. And it's located, okay, it's not located, but it's, uh, it's known to be like the trendy type hipster type place. So there's a lot of like, you know, local shops, such as like clothing stores, food stores, a lot of like health conscious, a lot of cafes, stuff like that. So typically what you get in those hipster spots, they have it here. It's also known for like the nightlife. There's a lot of lounges and clubs. Uh, here I personally didn't go to any but I, I saw the setups of the places they were located actually right by this this um, right by the water um, and the water faces inland so pretty much the water is gonna be much more calm than you're gonna get in other parts of the island and it's also much warmer as well but as you can see here um, actually at a barber shop honestly this is the hardest part about traveling is finding a barber um as you all know i'm sure um everyone has particular hair and everywhere you go they might not have that person that can do that hairstyle so i was lucky uh somebody to do my hair uh here in this neighborhood but after this um there's the next place we're in is choquina um it's actually a little bit further east on the actual coastline so this other one was inland this is the actual coastline so the waves are much bigger as you can see here the, like it's it's actually where most of the surfers go uh, i believe this is the best place on the island don't quote me on that but i think so like because the waves were much bigger the water is freezing cold uh it, it feels like being back let's say in san diego in the pacific trying to surf there oh no no don't get me don't get me <laughs> For you guys who like to surf, you definitely want to come to this beach. Uh, here is where you get the biggest waves, uh, Jacqueline Beach. So it's on the east side of the island. Big, big waves. The water is extremely cold. Honestly, it feels like surfing in the Pacific Ocean. Uh, very similar temperature. Yeah, guys, nice beach, very calm. I'm actually running from this water now. It's literally just stepping your feet in it. Like, literally. What's good, homies? So we're at the start of the Foreign Strategies Fitness Series. Your boy is working out at the Ironbird Gym here in Florianopolis, Brazil. Uh, one of the, actually, this gym is actually ranked number one in Brazil for weight equipment. So yeah, uh, so yeah guys, go ahead and get this started. Catch on. So now we're moving into the new part of the series or of our videos so pretty much what we're getting we're getting a lot of people asking us health advice uh fitness advice things of that sort and honestly i i, I kind of like that because me personally i like to think um that let's say let's say we're talking about success to me success is not being really good at one thing but being good at multiple things because when it comes to travel when it comes to finance when it comes to all of that stuff to me you got to have everything in line so if you let's say you're really good at something but your health let's say you like let's say you can make a lot of money but you're not healthy it doesn't matter because at the end of the day if you don't have your health what's the point of having anything else so we're gonna mix in uh, more working out fitness type of content um, as well as like nutrition uh, to help you guys out with that as well because at the end of the day in order to travel you got to have a lot of things in line 
in order to get the results you want to get when you travel you you, you got to be fit i mean you got to be fit you gotta you gotta be able to move a certain way and uh this is why we wanted to bring this to the channel so as you can see here we're just currently working out i i'm not gonna really speak about exactly like the sets the reps or anything in this video that will definitely come soon uh really just trying to figure out how to mix this in uh because honestly this is very different uh fitness content mixed in with travel content it's kind of it's it's, it's just different <laughs> you guys you guys i'm sure you guys you know what i'm trying to like say but uh the, the goal for me is to figure out how to mix this in how to make this beneficial to you guys and um that yeah so that's that's pretty much the key uh but from from now on um i think this is gonna be what what we're gonna not focus on but we're definitely gonna have this in majority of our videos obviously we're still gonna make pure travel content but um definitely mixing in the health and fitness part videos i think it's, it's key because the well-rounded individual is the person who succeeds the most right and and that's kind of and this is i kind of relate fitness and all this stuff back to travel right um people we travel because you are the person that travels has a better understanding of the world but understanding how things work and when you're fit you're just a more well-rounded person as well um you could you could do more things your quality of life is better so mixing the two is it's it's like that's the ultimate individual right you got your fitness right you got your finances right and you're well traveled i mean the world is yours man the world is yours so that's what me and delane want to bring to the channel uh hope you guys enjoy it some feedback would be kind of how how we can mix this in would be much appreciated because i'm i'm honestly i'm not sitting here saying i know exactly how i'm gonna mix this in but i'm gonna get it figured out it might take some time but we definitely appreciate you guys support and uh, until next time guys you all take care